It's going to be a webisode. Reality show. We don't happen to have a razor blade here, do we? Okay, so the title Convo Beer uh, came from, uh, I was looking through a gardener's dictionary and um, there was a species of plant that um, had, uh, it's Convo something, I can't remember, but uh, started looking into um, that word and um, it's basically Latin for uh, to, in, to intertwine or uh, roll together. You know, there are little vignettes and stories of people interacting with nature. They're growing with the architecture in the buildings. So I just kind of like that idea. It was when I first made, the first piece I did was the postcard piece. And so I just like that idea that these plants and houses were kind of just all mixed together and intertwi intertwining like uh, stems or branches and uh, plant forms. <laughs> so basically, did you just like gut yourself because you knew there was nothing else to save for later? Or what? Um, I mean, that's pretty much how I go about every show. Um, I just kind of I put in everything that everything that's here is everything that I have in my studio. Because because honestly, you don't look like a wreck. Like you're saying that <laughs> you only got one hour of sleep, but I, I don't well, know if I should believe night, you. Once I hung the show, I went to sleep. But before okay. that, I didn't. Well, for one thing, I was. Uh, just really interested in working with more colors yeah. from just a purely like visual standpoint. I was kind of like, I uh, just wanted to push it more and I just, <clears throat> I wanted to see what I could do by trying to be a little more colorful because in the past, like especially when I first started uh -huh. making paintings in this sort of style, I was really uh, concentrated on one sort of uh, palette. Yeah, I don't want to say that like the art blended with the frames before, right. but now the art really pops. Like, yeah, yeah. It's totally, it's more like a window than, right. you know, dressing. Yeah, you know yeah, I, mean? I know exactly what you mean. Uh, I also just kind of, as far as like the concepts go, I yeah. just started getting, yeah. when I started looking at the flowers and just doing reference things, uh -huh. it sort of just like, that just catapulted me into just a million ideas where yeah. what I wanted to say just about like, I don't know, just people and nature, and it was just like a whole new, uh, a whole new world, and just like, uh, I don't know, it just opened up what I was doing before into um, just concepts that I thought were a little more relevant, like, even though they seem may seem it still has a sort of like fantasy, fantasy or, old, yeah. old time, maybe from like a pa distant past type of thing. Let's say you look at this art and like you see the guys with the little hats and flutes and stuff, but that's that's not what comes to mind, yeah. you know, when you see you. You look more like, you know, art garage rocker or something <laughs> than a renaissance fair dude, you know? Well, yeah, I don't know, it's funny because when Eric first saw my stuff yeah. uh, a couple of years ago, he thought that I, that when he emailed me, he thought that I was like an old man. Yeah. 